My name is Dara Mulligan and I'm an Applications Engineer here at Maxim Integrated. Today I'm going to show you how to stay cool using the MAX 3205 temperature sensor as a standalone thermostat. The MAX 3205 is a high resolution temperature sensor that is 0.1 degree accurate over the human body temperature range and meets clinical thermometry specification ASTM E1112. It also includes an over temperature alarm that can be used to switch on a cooling fan, trigger an emergency shutdown or signal to reduce system clock speed. Its small size means that it can be designed into medical patches that can be worn to, to monitor heat or infections and can even be built into clothing. For our demonstration we use the MAX 3205 EVSYS, an N channel MOSFET, a MAX 32630 embed feather board and a basic 5 volt fan that's commonly found on Amazon. So let's get started. Firstly you'll need a laptop or PC running Windows 7 or later. Then we download the MAX 3205 EVSYS software from the product page. The MAX 3205 EVSYS consists of a MAX 3205, a micro USB cable, a ribbon cable and a USB TMB controller. Connect the boards together using the ribbon cable and connect to the PC. With the software installed we can open the GUI. As you can see, the software has a very simple layout and makes it easy to configure the device. The configuration register can be modified using the checkboxes highlighted here. In thermostat mode, we simply set bit D1, the comparator slash interrupt bit, to zero. This is the default value, so no need to change it in the software. In comparator mode, OS is asserted when the temperature rises above the over temperature value and is deasserted when the temperature drops below the T hist value. Next, we can set our threshold and hysteresis values. OS will assert when the threshold value has been passed, switching on our fan. After the temperature is dropped below our hysteresis value, OS will deassert and the fan will switch off. Now we need to program our MAX32630 feather board and program it with a simple code to tell our MOSFET to switch on when OS is asserted. For this, we need to go to embed.org. It is important to note that the default output voltage for a GPO on the feather board is 1.8. We need to add MAX32630 feather library files along with this line of code which activates the LDO and enables 3.3 volt to the GPO. Now we're ready to test. We can add heat to the temperature sensor and see how our design reacts. By touching the exposed pad on the board the temperature will rise above our threshold. Success. Our fan is turned on at a temperature of 30.906 degrees C. Now let's try to cool it down using the fan. After the temperature has dropped below our hysteresis value of 25 degrees, the fan switches off. Well there you have it, a human body temperature sensor that was guaranteed to keep you cool this summer. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video, I hope you learned something. Stay tuned for more Maxim Temperature Sensor videos in the future. See you next time.